today on the Gamer Bros. I am going to be playing Crave and I'm going to show you how to make a Battle Royale game. A simple, not really that hard really, but Battle Royale, I'll show you how to put out the storm and all that kind of stuff. I made, I think I made four of them, all different maps though. So. You can make all different maps and all that kind of stuff. I am also using the Jungle Scout. I can't remember what season it's from though. Let's see. I have a lot of. Uh, I got. Battle Royal. I think that's my first. I'm like, I'm like my second one better. Let's see if I can. Yeah. I think this is the one. One second, I'm gonna load in real quick. I have a lot more emotes, but I can't do a lot because that would be copyright, so. Alright, yeah. First, okay. First, you just want to build your map. I mean, it could be anything. Just anything, anything. Um, then what you want to do is, I'll show you all the settings and everything in a second. You want to go to consumables or whatever, um, guns you want, and you can choose the guns you want in your chest, so they actually just added the new mythics into Crave. They already added them into the pit too, so here, you know, just pick anyone, and if you press I play on PS4, so what I do, I press square, and I can add them to chest. So, let's see. I can do, let's see, one that's not that overpowered, but I can put the HK, and then I can put in a striker. So now, I create the chest. Now, it'll sp Wherever you put it, it'll just spawn up in the air, but then you can do the rest. Just place it down like I can place it right here. Try to get level, it's really not that hard. There we go, I have my chest. And then when I open it, one sec. Got all the supplies I put in. That's just how to do chest. There is also a gallery. Let's see. Okay, let's go to... Galleries. Maybe it's on. I mean, I can't remember. Um. I search it. Uh. Okay, that did not work. I know I have it somewhere. One sec. Um, where is it? Somewhere around here. So many games are too creative, it's crazy. Might be not even in it. Mm -hmm. One second. I can even find it. Where is it? Did it take it out? Anyway, you can find a chest gallery. It comes with all different chests. So, I have this one. It's just random. I didn't put any of this in. There's primal weapons in. I do do all of that. It comes with a pirate chest and all that kind of stuff. So, you can just place those around your map. You'll find it at some point. Um, yeah, just look around your map. I do have vehicle spawners into my map. They're under devices, and they're right here. You can customize them um, and all that kind of good stuff. And also in the gallery, it comes with ammunition boxes. Um, here, I did set up a secret place down here. And it comes with these right here. 
so. Oh crap, I just did that. Um, all that kind of stuff. I think you guys really just want to know how to do the settings, so. Oh, and probably the keys right here. For, these these are the, um, man. It's the advanced storm beacon, and in the middle you want advanced storm controller. So, let's go to the devices, and hopefully I can find them. I know they're in here somewhere. It's not that big. Right here? Okay. Advanced Storm Beacon. I use those. And I use the Advanced Storm Controller. Those right here. Now, you want those in the middle of your map. They will be invisible in your game, though. You won't even see them. See how mine goes bigger, bigger. There's not many more after that. So. Just super small. And you can set your time. So for this, this is how many rings you have right here. So I have four rings, I think. Maybe five. I can't remember. I think this one controller counts as one. Anyway, this is what the setting should look like. Phase four. Let's just find phase one. Phase one. End radius 300. Resize time one minute. Dam uh, damage. I do two percent. And then you want to do, for movement behavior, you want to do move to next beacon. Then just do shorter and shorter. You can do it as short as you want. Then it does 1% damage. I mean, and phase 3, 1%. I mean, I you can do however you want. Phase 4. Now for a storm controller, generate storm on start, yes. And phase 1 radius is 400 meters. So that's how you do the storm. I will play around in a sec to show you it actually does work. And for this, you want max players whatever you want. Probably free for all. If you want it to be, this matters, if you want it to be solo, duos, or whatever you want. Spawn limit one. Um, after last spawn, go to spectator. Total rounds, I did 24. Team rotation every round. Time limit, I did 20 minutes, but it never lasts that long. Most rounds win for the win condition. Last standing, ends game. You definitely want that on. And then join progress, spectate, spawn location, definitely the sky. Um, let's see. You want to allow spectating other teams on, but that doesn't really matter. Game start countdown, I did three, otherwise it takes forever. Around, uh, uh, allow friendly fire. I do have that, but you don't even need it. It just matters. Vehicle, all that kind of vehicle stuff. For the settings, I do 100% health. Max health, 100. No starting shields. 100 shields, though, to start with. You would just want most of this off. Maximum building resources, 999. Harvest style, battle royal, times 2. That's just me, because... I mean, it takes forever to get mats, so. Allow building all, allow aim assist, yes. Um, like I said, you can change these how you like it, but this is just how I have mine. Building can destroy environment, yes. For a true battle royal, you want that. Environment damage, all. Structure damage, all. Weapon destruction, 100%. Default, on, default, yes. Um down but not out you can change that to on but for unlimited players items that you want for drop let's see five seconds but you don't even need that but yes I mean they have to spectate fall damage oh I do need to turn that on I don't know why I don't have that um gotta put that on glider redeploy off some of these I don't even know why I had that um, there is, you can do all different kinds of stuff. That is, I think it, you can do that high back bling, but why would you want to do that? That's just me. Here, I'll start it. I can. 
I got primal. I don't really think primal's now. Had two right there. Now there's nobody in this. But now I can break this. I have weapon destruction. Now once you... If everything happens to your map or it gets really broken, not while you're creating it, but while you're playing it, it'll just regenerate. But you have to make sure you start the game, of course. Why did it just give me a grenade? I messed up. I don't know if they have added the new weapons in. There's... I think there's just... Oh. I got a nut. Primal. I don't know if they updated these. I don't even know if you can find them anymore. You might have to create your own chest, but... Yeah. It's just primal. Now, here's my vehicles. I did make them invisible. Let's see. Now, you can place as many chests as you want. You can... Do whatever I mean. I think I did create some of these, so. Here, let's see if we can get that storm. You can see on your mini map, the storm is closing in. As you can see, it's closing in right now. 24 seconds left. And it does deal damage. Now, you can definitely change this to way higher. I think I am. And what? I'm going to kill myself. And again. So that is it for today. Make sure you like and subscribe this video. And I'll probably do another video in the next 10 seconds. Bye.